Welcome to my CBSE English teacher. Today let's learn the lesson The Browning Version by Terence Rattigan from Class 11 English. If you're watching my video for the first time, consider subscribing. You can listen to the explanations of lessons from classes 10, 11 and 12 English. Don't forget to press the bell icon so that you get notified whenever I upload a video. Let's move on to the lesson now. About the author, Sir Terence Rattigan was a British dramatist. He was one of England's most popular mid-20th century dramatists. His plays are typically set in an upper middle class background. He wrote The Winslow Boy, The Browning Version, The Deep Blue Sea and Separate Tables among many others. Introduction. The Browning version presents a conversation between a lower fifth grade student Taplo and Mr. Frank, a teacher from the school where Taplo studies. From their conversation, we come to know that Taplo is there to do some extra work and extra duty as punishment for his teacher Mr. Crocker Harris. In the absence of Mr. Crocker Harris, we get to know a lot about him through Taplo's conversation with Mr. Frank. Let's look at the summary of the play, the Browning version. The play presents a conversation between a lower fifth grade science student, Taplo, and Frank, a teacher. The scene of the play is set in a school. The play opens with a 16-year-old boy, Taplo, who has come to do extra work for his teacher, Crocker Harris. He is waiting for his teacher, who has not yet arrived. Another teacher, Frank, finds Taplo waiting in the room and strikes a conversation with him. From the conversation between Frank and Taplo, we are informed that Taplo is waiting for his result to be declared on the following day. He is keen to specialize in science, provided he gets a favorable result. The uniqueness of Mr. Crocker Harris is hinted as he does not tell the results like the other teachers do. He follows the rule of the headmaster declaring the results on the last day of the term. The conversation provides an insight into the mind of Taplow. He lets Frank know how much he dislikes the play Agmenon. He is more interested in science. He admits that though the play is not that bad, the way it is taught is terrible. Just a lot of Greek words strung together and 50 lines if you get them wrong. Taplow is doing extra work as he had missed a class a week ago. Frank remarks that Taplow will certainly get his remove for doing the extra work. But Taplow feels the other way. He asserts such sort of rules do not work with Mr. Crocker Harris as he is not like other teachers who appreciate the students who do extra work. As per Taplow, Crocker Harris is a different kind of teacher. He is too strict and hardly human. Unlike other teachers, he does not tell his students their result before the judgment day. Taplow had asked Harris about his remove and in response Harris told him that he has given Taplow exactly what he deserves, no less and certainly no more. After calling Taplow for extra work, Crocker Harris himself is late by 10 minutes. Frank points out that Crocker is late, Taplow has a chance to leave and play golf. However, Taplow seems shocked at this suggestion and is scared that Mr. Crocker Harris might follow him home. Frank admits envying Mr. Harris for the effect he has on his students. He asks Taplow if Mr. Harris beats them. However, Taplow tells Frank that unlike one or two of the other teachers, Mr. Harris is not a sadist. He is not a sort of a person who would beat students and vent his frustration. He is hard like a nut. He is heartless. He possesses no feelings at all. Taplow admits that in spite of all this, he still likes Crocker Harris. The boy narrates an incident when he laughed at a classical joke cracked by Crocker Harris, though he had not understood it. 
It was a gesture from Taplow's side to be polite to him. Harris did not like that and asked him to explain the joke to the whole class, which he could not. At this point, Millie Crocker Harris enters the room. She was Mr. Crocker Harris's wife. She suggests that Taplow to run away for a quarter of an hour and come back. She advises him to leave as Harris has been at the bursars and may take quite a time to get back. The behavior and attitude of Mrs. Millie Crocker Harris baffles Taplow. He is not willing to leave for it has been the order of his teacher whom he fears to disobey. Millie assures him that she will take the blame on herself. Proposing an excuse for his absence, she hands Taplow a prescription, asking him to take it to a chemist and get it made up for Harris. Convinced, Taplow accepts the proposal and leaves Frank and Mrs. Crocker Harris behind. Questions and Answers Question number 1. Compare and contrast the two teachers mentioned in the play. Answer. The two teachers are Mr. Crocker Harris and Frank. Crocker Harris teaches Latin language while Frank teaches science. Crocker Harris is middle-aged and strict. Frank is a young science teacher. The students are scared of Crocker Harris. Frank wonders how Crocker Harris had managed to overawe the students, though he does not even beat them. Frank is envious of him. Question number 2. Taplow says that Crocker Harris is hardly human. What makes him say that? Answer. Taplow is a little outspoken boy. He speaks out of his mind honestly. His personal equation with Crocker Harris is not smooth. One day, Mr. Crocker Harris told a Latin joke in the class and no one laughed at it because not a single student understood it, including Taplow. Still, Taplow laughed out of politeness. But then his teacher asked him to explain the joke. This makes Taplow feel that he is hardly human. Question number 3. What brings Taplow to the staff room? Who does he meet there? Answer. Taplow, a fifth grade student, goes to the school on the last day. He is called by Mr. Crocker Harris to do extra work for missing a single day the previous week. He is waiting for the Latin teacher in the staff room. Frank, the young science teacher, arrives and starts talking to him. They discuss Crocker Harris. In fact, Frank is envious of Crocker Harris' hold on the young boys. I hope you liked today's video. For more interesting videos, do subscribe to my CBSC English teacher. If you really like this video, please like, share and give your valuable comments. And don't forget to subscribe. Thank you for watching.